It's a brave new world in the medical field with lasers being used to treat and manage pain. With the wave of a wand, a Victoria Clinic says the laser light reduces inflammation and accelerates healing. Along with the laser, thermal imaging maps the pain and helps locate the source. Mary Beth Burton has more on the latest non-invasive technology. You'll be just taking a picture of where your pain is. Deirdre Campbell comes to Valentis Clinics with hand and forearm pain, but thermography shows something else. In this case, her pain originates more in the shoulder capsule area. Naturopathic Dr. Karen Jensen sees it all the time. Even though you have pain here and down your arm, there's a muscle group back here that actually refers pain down into the lateral elbow. Jensen says thermography maps the pain. The white and red areas are the most inflamed. Then she uses a laser to treat it. It helps with wound healing. And one of its main factors is increasing ATP, which is energy to the cells. The light energy coming from this wand is said to eliminate pain quickly. It also uh, works to reduce inflammation and it works to accelerate healing. Dan Hargraves is a bus driver with back pain for years. The upper back is you like this all day long. It's same as if you're on the computer, you're like this all day, right? So tight chest and a strained upper back. After three laser treatments at a cost of $60 a session, Dan says his mobility changes were drastic. I was out there in Chimane, in the back country getting logs. I mean, I get logs three, four feet high, you know, like this, and I'm picking them up, carrying them across the road, and putting them in the utility trailer. My son says, Dad, you're back. I said, I'm back, man. I feel like a teenager. You kidding? Careful, I'm going to wrestle you down. But the clinic would rather let technology make their diagnosis. Because they feel so good that they're actually all better. <laughs> and we like to take a picture to make sure that they actually have healed. The same heat-seeking thermography is used for a comprehensive breast health program. Along with the thermal images, a small device called SureTouch, similar to an ultrasound, maps the breasts. The program is available to all, but might appeal most to women under 40 who don't get free annual mammograms because... Younger women have denser breast tissue, so the mammography is less effective. And two is the radiation that gets left behind in the breast tissue. 11% of Canadian women will develop breast cancer, most of them over 50. But girls as young as 13 have been diagnosed with the disease. I have a daughter who's 19, and as I have history of breast health or issues in my family, um, breast cancer, that it was nice to know that she could come and have it done at an early age. Once the thermography report is done on the breast, it's sent off to a medical doctor for analysis and returned to the patient who can then pass it on to her doctor. The breast health program costs $350 for the first session and includes a three-month follow-up exam. If there's no change from between one and three months, that becomes the baseline, the thermal fingerprint for that person. If there is something that suggests that there needs to be follow-up, then they can go into the um, traditional medical system and, and pursue those. Debbie Biggin considers the private program a good investment in her own health. I think this is more preventative and um, just being able to take care of your bodies and sort of have peace of mind. Both the breast health and the laser pain treatments are often partially covered by extended health benefits. In Victoria, Mary Beth Burton, A News.